Hello, some viewers. How are you all? Welcome back from the video. Guys, in this video, we are going to see how we can encrypt and decrypt using this another tool, 7-Zip. If you don't have this tool, go to this website, 7-Zip.org slash download.html. You can download it based on the Windows system or a Mac OS or a next you can download the software. My, I have downloaded the software. If you want to download, please just click on this and the exe file will be downloaded. From there, you can follow the installation process. So now guys, let me open this. So in the previous session, we would have seen the second text.exe. This is the content present in the file. Now I want to encrypt this file. For encrypting guys, just right click here. If you're using Windows 11, click on more options. Just click on 7-zip, add to archive. The only thing you have to understand here is we're adding to archive. Only we are focused on this section. We have AES-256, which is a powerful encryption algorithm. This is 256 bit. Now I can add anything here. Just write the password. Let's click on OK. Now the file is created. You can see .7z as an extension. Now you can send this file to your in your organization and the the person who is taking this file has to have 7z installed. He has to do like this, right click, open with, or show more options, 7zip, open archive. Once you open it, double click this. So now it will ask you for the password. Okay. You have to enter the password. Click on OK. Now it should have been added. See, the file now has opened. This simple encryption method. You can encrypt the bulk files. You can encrypt n number of files. Even you can encrypt the files which has like size, megabytes, gigabytes, etc. Hope you have liked the video, guys. If you like the video, please click on like. If you're a new viewer, please click on subscribe. Till then, guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye bye.